your thoughts? Oh, re real excited to be in the tournament. You know, it's I think it's a wide open tournament this year, and, and a lot of really good teams. And um, you know, it, it, I think it's a lot of you know. I, I thought we'd be in, and, and just happy about the year to this point. And it's a new season, so looking forward to getting started Thursday night down at A&M. And hosting the uh, regional here in Lexington. Oh, it's you know we've known that for a long time, and you know now it's you got to try and get there. And um, but. You know, it's a, a lot of respect from the NCAA to, to give us the opportunity to host a regional and, um, you know, exciting time for volleyball in this part of the country. Dayton's your opponent. Your thoughts about Dayton? What do you Dayton, know about him? Dayton's a good friend of mine. He's the head coach there. Played elementary baseball against him back in the day in elementary school. So um, very well-coached team, good good uh, defensively, good, uh, very competitive group on the A-10 and, and uh, played a lot of good teams this year. So it's going to be a fun match. You guys worked hard all season to get to this point, and you had to figure that you were going to be in. But was there still a sense of relief once you saw your name up there that you didn't know it was going to be there? I'd be awfully disappointed if I didn't see our <laughs> name there. I mean, I, I think we played a tough enough schedule. I think we had a lot of good wins. and um, But, you, you know, you get chills, you know, watching the selection show when it first pops up and you, and you see your name there. And regardless of uh, who you're playing, where, or what, it's, it's uh, you know, I'm excited for our players because they put a lot of – a lot, of t a lot of time and energy, and, and there's only 64 teams still playing, and really excited we're one of them. You guys had a, a really good chance at, at hosting first, second round, but are there still positives that you can take from going on the road or the things that you might benefit from that you wouldn't if you were at home in terms of focusing on task at hand? Uh, yeah, I mean, you know, it's, when you go on the road in the tournament, it's, it's uh, you know, it's us against everybody, and, and you know, you got to you got to do a good job preparing on the road during the season to, to help you get prepared for something like that, like this in the tournament. Um, you know, I'm, I'm disappointed for the SEC. I thought both Tennessee and us uh, play, had a great, good enough season, played enough good quality opponents, had good enough wins this year to, uh, you know, have a chance to be seated, if not seated higher. And, and uh, but, you know, that's that's part of the tournament. I'm also surprised that. You know, three of the top teams in the country are also playing the same regional, which is pretty unusual. Um, but, you know, when you get in the bracket, you just got to play, and, and Dayton's on Thursday night, so that's what we need to focus on. Speak to the advantage of having.